welcome and welcome back to our channel, The Big King Family. I'm Yolanda, the mother of the Big King Family. And today I will be talking to you guys, well, showing you guys a Dollar Tree haul. One of the first things I really want to show you guys in this haul, it's a pretty big one, so I'm going to get right into it. It's something that's been on my list of items to find. And I found it today, which is these big, this big, big, humongous bottle of scent bees. These bees smell so good. And they are the 17.5 ounce bottle. It is a humongous bottle for a dollar and 25 cent. You can't beat the deal. <laughs> are these, well, these are like blue light. These are in the scent. I can't get over the scent. It smells just like downy, I swear. And we used to actually buy the downy and gain scented ones. All the fireworks, whatever, whatever you want to uh, call them. All of the different kinds. You know, I was coupon. I was trying to get them very, very cheap. Man, these things are so expensive, though. They're very expensive. I tried to get them cheap as I could, but we stopped buying them. I felt like it was a waste of money and stuff, but they definitely help increase the smell of your laundry when it comes out of the wash. You want to put a cap full of this into your wash, and when it comes out, that gives that extra smell before you even have to add the dry sheets. I definitely, this is just odor eliminator. A in wash aroma booster and odor eliminator just help your clothes smell better that's all this does for it huge bottle I'm gonna try to pop up on the screen how big the gain and the um, downy bottles be when you buy those real big bottles and how much they be you're talking about in upwards of 15 to 20 bucks great great fine so I got a lot of them I got a lot of them you guys I got a lot of them. I think every time I run into them, I'm probably going to try to get four or five if it be on the shelf. The shelves, Lord have mercy. They have been empty because that, today, this was my third Dollar Tree I was at today. And this is the first time I ever saw them at the Dollar Tree or ever paid any attention to them. So happy about this find. Woo we, we, I, I do not buy these, but I will buy them at the Dollar Tree. On the side of the bottle, I know anybody can read the directions, but it says don't put it into the fabric softener or the bleach dispenser because you just throw it right into the wash. Another item that was about the scent boosters, you know, but, you know, and that was for me too. That's why I really just kind of looked at them, you know, really good about how to kind of use them or whatnot. But we used to buy the downy ones all the time. Yeah, we would just put them into the wash and you talking about it would, it would have your clothes smelling so good. Okay. All right, you guys, another item that i have really really been trying to find i can i really been trying to find it y'all i hope you guys are doing good today hope you're doing well today is saturday and this will go up saturday evening you know i always i do my videos and i upload them i don't i can't wait on them can't sit on them when i've been done upload the video you guys i've been done the video that day pretty much at one time i was trying to schedule them and all that i just i'm not that type of person i roll too much i'll be doing too much so my best bet is to just do the video and upload it to you guys. I really be missing y'all. Be wanting to talk to y'all, deal with y'all. All right. I know y'all know what I got in my hand. This is the Quiet and Roar, the body lotion though. This is your lavender plus spir spir you Spirulina Spirulina scent. I don't know exactly how to pronounce that. Spirulina scent, lavender scent lotion. Now this stuff, it is real thick. You know, it's real thick. Hold right on it. Look at that. Look at that. Real thick, real thick and good. I checked it. Some of that lotion just pour right onto your damn, right onto your hand. Excuse me, y'all. <laughs> but some of that stuff just pour right onto your hand. It'll pour right onto your hand. Uh uh. No. This right here. This right here, y'all. This the real deal. And, you know, I have been watching other Dollar Tree hauls, and they say it's a Procter & Gamble um, product. With, with Procter & Gamble, they make Tide. Yeah, I see it right here, distributed by Procter & Gamble. Okay. No one is pretty good. But Quiet and Roar, I've never seen it on any shelves. They may have had it in Target or something. I've never seen it on the shelf anywhere. I've just never really kind of noticed it. This is a 16 fluid ounce of lotion. It really is. Let me get the lotion off me. I'd be so excited to go to Dollar Tree and to find different things, full size name brand items is always the best. Um, this Quiet and Warm, I really, I got quite a few of them also. And I went ahead and 
got quite a few. I've been looking because you know me myself. I've been really looking for them for a while. So I got four and I got five of them also. Five of these body lotions. I still have yet to run into the body wash, but when I do, I plan on loading up on them also. Wonderful. It's hard to find a real good lotion and it feels so good. It's hard to find a pretty good lotion, you know, for a reasonable price these days. These lotions are in seven, eight, and nine dollars, some more than that. I don't know what the deal is, uh, what kind of special lotion they got special powers or what I don't know, but these lotions are, are out of hand. So I did get five of this quiet and war, raw um, lotion. Okay, you guys, the lavender scent. They may have even, they may even have other scents. I hope I can find it. You know, God is so good. I'm even thankful to God for that. Um, the scent boosters and the lotion were the two things I really, really wanted to find at Dollar Tree. So thankful I was able to find those. Um, I'm gonna continue to watch Dollar Tree hauls. Something I really want to try. That I really want to try. Are a couple of different crackers I've seen, and then there's this little uh, biscuit bar, little biscuit, in a little box. Uh, when I get, if I can get them, I probably will try those. These right here, I had got the cotton candy fago, cotton candy fago. Um, two of them are gone because I have one, and I, it's a four pack. It'd be a four pack in Dollar Tree. And my husband had bought it one time before, but uh, he didn't, um, the kids and stuff didn't like it, but I liked it. So I bought a four pack, you know, I could buy it just for me. You come out blue like that, put on some ice. I also had got this plastic, it's plastic, not glass, plastic glass cup. They should call it plastic glass because it looked like a glass for real, beautiful, nice glass. But it's plastic, and that's exactly what I need with my grandchildren and my child. I need plastic glass. <laughs> also, y'all, I got one of these headbands. I'm probably gonna keep going a little bit through this one since all the other things I got. I think I only got like kind of like one of them. Oh, I did get one more thing that was on my to find list. Oh, I can't wait to show y'all. But this right here, it's really soft and bendy. There's a black and white one of these that I want, you know. I don't know if I can get it. Yeah, you know, like when I real, wear my real hair, it's going to be kind of curled up, but pushed back. Should try to do a few little edges, and that's probably how I'm going to wear my real hair for the summer. Tippy put me up these braids right here. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus, for a daughter that, that knows how to braid. Also, she did these braids for me, and I've been rocking them ever since for about the past week or so. Man, it's been a while, maybe two weeks. But, um, yeah. Trying to hold on to them as long as possible. I've been wrapping them bad boys and everything. Trying to hold on to them as long as I can. Because my, doing my hair is just not an option right now. Um, be too busy, Lord. Hey, man. But these well uh, crackers, these are in uh, comparison to the cheeses. I have a daughter named Yasmin. She loves the cheeses. She absolutely loves cheeses. One day she said, Mom, you can't get the cheeses. Because we looked at them. They were four seventy eight. Uh, either Walmart or Kroger app. They're just regular price. They didn't need to stop. But anyway, and somewhere they five dollars and some change. What are they doing, cheese? It. What are you doing? But <laughs> these right here are in comparison. She said, "Mom, just give me some wells." So I got them from Kroger or Walmart. I can't remember which one, and they were three dollars and twenty eight cents. These right here were a dollar twenty five. Still real good by Stouffer's. The uh, Best Buy day I already had looked at was January twenty four. So about a year out. I should have got all four boxes that was there. I should have. Because in a regular grocery store, these are $3 and some change. Name, brand, full-size item. All right. Got her a box of the cheese crackers. Hey, got. I'm going to show that later because I know I got two of those. Oh, I got these. Look at it. Look, look, look. This is going to be my next. I ain't got none on right now. I'm probably going to put these on probably tonight. These are gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. And I bought these. Oh, it's. The camera ain't doing them justice because they got some little, uh, you might can see them a little right there. Yeah, they got little diamonds on, on the bottom of it. And I don't like to wear mine this long. What I'll do is put them on, cut them down, and file them down softly, you know, to where it won't be scratchy or nothing. So, man, but only 12 come in there. I wish I had to pack enough to do two, enough to do two sets, but only 12 come in here. Hey, for $1.25, you can't really beat it. And there were some kiss nails in there. 
two sets of kids nails i didn't like them they were short like i liked them but i just didn't like the color on them so i did not get those um but don't worry when i see some kiss nails that i like in there i'm definitely gonna load up on them those are the kind i use as kiss i really love the kiss nails really the kiss impress classy line that line of kiss nails it looks almost as if you went to the shop you file your nails down and make sure that you have them seamless in your bed because you want to push your nail cuticles back not where they hurt just push them back and lo and behold a lot of people give me compliments on my nails once I get them done. But these right here are beautiful. I'm going to put these on. All right. Moving on from the nail. They look a little, they look a little clear like. And I was wanting to put like a glitter nail polish on top of these. Once I put them on, I wanted to put a clear glitter nail polish on top of them to give them kind of a more of a classier, kind of prettier look to me. I just think that's so pretty to me. So, I will see how that goes. A lot of people don't too much have glitter on their nails. But I do like the glitter polish. I just thought it would just give a little ump to it to put that over these. But anyway, we'll go from there. I didn't get it today because they didn't have any in Dollar Tree. And they normally do. Okay, I did get this Softy. Softy is a, a, a name brand. Hydrating Olive Oil Oil. You know, they have those other oils in Dollar Tree. I'm probably going to pop it up here. My daughter, Cheyenne, she uses it, I think, for her hair. She uses them for her hair, but she said she might be interested in using some of these. They had three different kinds of these. There were three different kinds, and I any mini mighty mo like I always do. I always say any mini mighty mo and all that, you know. And I do that until I get get to one, cause today I could only get one, and I got the hydrating olive oil one for her. But there are several other kinds, and uh, yeah, there's a Brazilian one I know. It may be Brazilian mango. And then there's another one also, coconut oil one. So this is the olive oil one. Uh-huh. So I hope she likes that. Let me see if it got a seal on it. Because one of them was just, yeah. Yeah, this got a seal on it. So that's good. It got a good seal on it. I'm going to give that to her. All right. Moving on. All right. The other bolo find that I had found was this. Oh, my Lord. What a, I just love Dollar Tree, especially when they have the name brand full size items. This I found. This, it is the what is it called? Free Lovely by Bolicology. That's what my daughter had got me for Mother's Day. The Bolicology. It's a. It's called the Pink White something. Pink White is some kind of fragrance. Pink White. She got me the lotion and the body spray, and it smells so good. And my daughter Carlana, she layers it with her Versace. With her Versace, she layers it with that body spray. I'm like, what? I, I, said, I don't know nothing about no layering, no sprays and, and different scents and stuff, but I'm gonna have to get with it. But anyhow, that smells so good about body ecology. So I say anything about body ecology, I don't mind trying. Just trying, and then we'll go from there. I don't know how body ecology ended up in the Dollar Tree, but I been on the hunt. I want to find, I don't think, I, don't, I haven't seen nobody haul nobody wash. Now, I would love to get the body wash by Botecology, but if, and I haven't seen nobody haul any lotion by Botecology. I've seen the Botecology uh, bath bombs. I think I did see somebody uh, haul these scrubs, um, the the but, the body creams or the body butters, body butters, body scrubs, and hand lotion, and the and the uh, bath bombs. Those are the four items that I've seen by Botecology that was in Dollar Tree. Somebody had hauled them, and I watched it on the video. Um, and this is your coconut and rose. I know that's going to smell real good. Coconut rose. I got one for me. And I also got one for Cheyenne. Because she is, she's just a beauty queen. And she really does so much stuff with beauty. She does. But she don't do body. Body. Literally body products. And it comes with a good seal on there. You cannot beat that. It comes with a real good seal on there. I think one that I opened in Dollar Tree. I just wanted to try to smell it. That's it. And then I opened it, and that seal was broken. But this one right here, this is mine, so, you know. Yeah, they did, it, it's kind of, but you can press it and stuff. And that's the consistency of it. <laughs> it smells pretty good, too. All right. But, you know, when they say body scrub, you know, and then I'm not no real little lady. So, I was just like, body scrub, does it really 
this little jar, you would really take care of your whole body, you know, and how many times can you use it, whatnot. I've seen some body scrubs a little bigger than this. Tree Hut and Dr. Till's is a little bit bigger than this, you know, so I don't know. <laughs> yeah, first body scrub that I've ever had, and I'm willing to try it by Botecology. I was so glad to find those. So glad to find those. Let me put that back up one more time. And the packaging, just gorgeous. Literally gorgeous, I'm telling you. Gorgeous. That's the coconut and rose body scrub. I did see a lot of the pride items in this Dollar Tree I was in. A lot of people have been hauling them. The pride, I saw the pride butter. I'm tempted to go ahead and buy that uh, pride body spray. It smelled good. It really do, that pride body spray do. And then you got that pride butter was in there. And all other stuff. I pride, pride got the scrubs in there and everything. And it was a line that was at Target. It was at Target. Some people say they saw it in Walmart, but it was also at Target. And now, um, so I believe Target and Walmart is pulling different things, you know. Two Dollar Tree, I don't know if it don't sell. It don't mean it's a bad product. It don't mean it's a malfunction in it. Sometimes they mass produce and they will send um, those extra items to Dollar Tree. I know this because a Dollar Tree manager actually told me this. So, awesome, awesome, awesome. Get some good information to know, you guys. Okay. And I had got two of these Fisher Price. Baby wipes, there's nothing exciting. Too exciting. It's exciting for the little bums. It's exciting for my uh, son and my grandbaby bums. So uh, we just get extra wipes to reinforce when they go to the potty and uh, use it in wipes and all that. So I got two extra of them. You can always use those. But we normally get like this really humongous box from um, Sam Club or else um, Walmart. Just a big box of them. I got to get a big box, Lord. So, and. I got this book. It's a kindergarten. So that's right up Doonabug Alley. And it's a number book where you're counting and you, your numbers. Doonabug can count his butt up. He can count. He recognizes numbers because when numbers are on the TV, he'll say three or he'll say nine. He recognizes it when he see it on the TV. Because we be watching countdown stuff, stuff that you count down. But uh, this right here, like you're going to count what's up there. And then he's going to trace this with a with a pen or a crayon he's going to trace that i want him to know how to write it and how to spell it that could be the start of the words that he learned like one and five it could be the start of words that he learned by looking at them and knowing what it says and reading uh it says kindergarten so i'm right on the right track he's four years old to try to start teaching him different um aspects of education right so i'm very happy to have that i was i have a printer so I probably could go online and print out different coloring pages for him and my grandbaby team. I want to do that. And I really, I, I may even print out different learning activities also. I just thought about that sitting here. All right, so I will keep that in mind. I know somebody else opened these. They're open. This, uh, okay, I've been to three different Dollar Trees and I probably went to one two days before this. But, you know, somebody in the kitchen was over me. I got these lemon cream filled cookies, sandwich cookies. One pound for $1.25. That's a good deal for $1.25. So, I did get those lemon cookies. I've been looking at these chocolates. I watch a lady named Erica. She do a lot of Dollar Tree House. And she be um, just really talking about those sea salt caramel chocolates. And I just passed them on up today. But they did look so delicious. Thinking about trying those. And then the butter crackers. They're like club crackers. And then the rich crackers in the red box in Dollar Tree. I mean, any Dollar Tree lovers or whatever ever who's watching this video know what I'm talking about. Those three items. And I really want to try them. And I will when I don't be just in need of so much stuff. The body stuff would normally get me like these nails. And that, um, well, this is my first time having a body scrub. And I'm so glad I can try a name brand product from the Dollar Tree first and try to see how that goes i need so much organization for my house i need so much uh household items for my house and health and beauty items for my house that i haven't got to the point that i can just be trying different foods and stuff but i did get a few food items like you're gonna name right here i saw this sunny d in there this is the big regular size one 56 fluid ounce it is the orange strawberry one and it don't look bad on the bottom and then like that you know how it settles at the bottom and look real rough and stuff no, this looks good. Yes. And um, it is pretty fresh. It don't go out of date till September 23. And it's just turned June. So I know for a fact it'll be gone. They didn't have but two on the shelf. I just took one because I just want to try it. 
And then that's the name brand, regular size, Sunny D, not a smaller Sunny D. I did get, like I said, I got a lot of stuff in the house I really want to load up on. I want to start getting some things from Dollar Tree that I know I can use, that I will use in the house. It's certain things I've gotten from Dollar Tree, though, that they just don't like. But I opened up those scent, those scent boosters right there from my husband all the way down. They were like, woo, those smell good, mom. They smell just like downy scent beads. I swear. Ooh, for real. Put my right hand up to that one. Go get them, y'all. They smell good. If you want to put a little boost of scent into your washing. So all right, you guys. I did get some fabric softeners. I got this, um, this French lavender one. It smells so good. You can smell it outside the box. And it has 40 sheets in there. So that's a pretty good amount of sheets. I'm going to try this one with our clothes. And if it does really well, I will continue to get these. Unless I can get... When I can get an item couponing for less than $1.25, I feel like it's worth it. Uh, but, you know, it depends. It's some things that my husband really like. Like the Tide in the Game and Scott Tissue. I like the Scott Tissue myself. So we're going to just get those. But try to use a, con a, 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 a condom. But try to use... <laughs> Try to use a um, I'm gonna try to use a coupon on them. Coupon on them, excuse me, y'all. All right, and then this is another set of dry sheets. I guess this is compared to the bounce. This smells really good. 40 coming there. And there's one more kind of there. These are not as strong as these. These smell a lot better. And these are just not as strong, but if you want a little scent on your clothes out the dryer, they're gonna smell pretty good with that one also. So, you know, like, I'm learning right now which ones I really kind of want and don't want to deal with or whatnot, you know. Also, you guys, look what I got. I bought this. I hope it works out. I'm not even going to go through it right now. When I do go through it, I will be. it'll be in a vlog. I got this little bitty diffuser, okay? A little bit of a diffuser. I want to put it in a little spot, probably like our back room. Because don't nobody really be back here. I'm not going to really be doing too much. So, I probably could sit in our bathroom and use it as a diffuser. And then I got, to me, it smells so good. This is, uh, I hope I can get it to focus. I don't know how to be doing that to get it to focus. But this is dragon fruit. Dragon fruit oil. And it, uh, I think I smelled it in the store. Ooh. Yeah, that, that scent hit you, so... They really got the ones that look like this are pretty strong. They got some more that just really don't hit, you know, like the, the smell don't hit. So it's in this, these little type of bottles. They hit. This is a dragon fruit one. With this simmering off, you know, it should smell really good. It really should smell really good. I'm, I'm going to tighten this because it, it had a problem, problem with leaking. I'm going to set it up here. It had a problem with leaking a little bit. I'm going to just put that in there. Yeah, the coloring book and fabric sheet back in here. I don't really want to do all that. Okay, did I show everything that was in here? Yeah, I showed everything that was in there. Okay, we only got one more bag. One bag, you guys. One bag. I don't want this to be too long. I did. I ended up getting, something told me, 150 of these uh, coffee filters. At We didn't have any coffee filters. You know how we was doing our coffee? We was folding uh, three paper towels. Uh, four ways putting it in there and then putting the coffee in there and a few grinds we're getting through but we were making the coffee drinks you know we hey, we kind of uh rigged it up there in order to kind of keep our coffee maker rolling in order to do the coffee drinks but and with the keurig all we had to do was just set the little cup in there and we were good to go to make the cups once do say about that keurig but uh now i do have filters for my coffee maker okay 150 of them man that'll last a while i did get another one of the soft this one's very oh my god that's so gorgeous they had a white one a cream color one like i think it was white or cream color and there was another color i can't remember that color oh, this one is soft as the okay this one ain't quite as soft as the other one i'm i don't know why i'm liking how no these are cute they'll be cute once i curl my hair up and pull push them have let it help push my hair back and it, but they're soft you know i like how the ends are you know they're mushy they're soft because them hard ones i wouldn't mind doing the hard ones because they work real good they kind of some of them have little combs even in there where to calm your hair back a little bit and stuff but hey i gotta go with these i gotta i gotta make sure i don't have no headaches so i got this one also here it is in this in this dry see i got that got that brown one. it's real flimsy and stuff too but i don't care i want soft 
And those bands that go all the way around your head, they don't stay on my head. My head real big anyway. But it don't stay on my head. It don't it always slip up off my head. I, I don't know what I got going on, what I be doing. Is that everything? I think that is everything, you guys. Thank you guys for hanging out with me, for talking to me, dealing with me. Dollar Tree is my stuff. All my Dollar Tree fans out there, please let all let us all stick together. I love my Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree is just a blessing. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for listening. And until next time, YouTube, stay blessed.